try. This is my first try at cauliflower pizza. Um, had one medium sized head. Probably can make two pizzas, but we're just gonna try one at first. Um, so I put ran through the food processor. Now I'm gonna microwave it and then put it in the, in the, in the pan for a second to saute it. We'll see how this comes out. All right. Under the sun. All right, so after I um, twist it in and get most of the moisture out of it, the cheesecloth, I decided to saute it to a little bit to even get some more of the moisture out. So it's like five or six minutes here. And I think this, um, because you want to make it as dry as you can. Yeah, this is like on a medium lowish. Um, between three and four. And you don't want to turn it brown. You don't want to saute it like that. You just want to keep kind of playing with it till you quit hearing that little crispy and the crackling noise. I think that's the water cooking out of it. It's kind of want to dry it out. All right, so here's the big guy. And um, we're going to do this. Cauliflower crust pizza. The cauliflower is about cooled off over there. We're going to put in one egg. And we are going to beat it up. Okay, here's our cauliflower. And it looks, you know, we got it pretty dried out. Show you another video. So now we're gonna add this cauliflower to it. And this um, cup of a mixture of Parmesan and mozzarella cheese. And we're gonna stir it up. So basically, turn it into a little ball, a little bit of garlic, thyme seasoning herbs, I'm gonna go in there. I'm just gonna go under the parchment here in a minute. Okay, we're gonna put it in the oven. About 20 minutes on 400. See what it looks like. We'll see if this cheese egg binds together with the cauliflower and actually forms some kind of a cup. It looks like a pizza. Viable. Yeah. It's not falling apart. Well, put some toppies on it. Sure. 